One of the most important resources you have for your CFS program is your user manual. The CFS manual can be accessed in a couple of different ways. In most of your CFS programs, you can press your F1 key and the manual will automatically load. The F1 function will only pull up your CFS manual if you are connected to the Internet or you have a copy of the CFS manual saved in your data folder. The manual is available in all programs except MapDraw and the Advanced Labor Module. Another way to access your CFS manual is to go to your Utilities tab, click on System Information, and then click CFS Manual. This will open the CFS manual either from our website or the data folder. Once you have the CFS manual open, you can always download it and save it to a convenient place on your computer so that you can have it even when disconnected from the Internet. I'm going to save this straight into my data folder. Now I'll open the one I have saved on my computer. In the CFS manual, you'll find information on all of the programs and special features of CFS. The table of contents outlines the subjects of the manual and on what page each section begins. For a quick way to find a particular subject, I like to use the Control F command to search the manual. For instance, I need to review how to use mobile mode in CFS. So control F. I'll type in mobile. Hit enter. And next. Next. Aha, here's what I want. A complete rundown on how to use mobile mode. Reading the manual can be extremely helpful in learning how to use the program. It can mean the difference between getting the most out of your program or missing out on some of the great features it has to offer.